making two simple holders for the shift box. Put all the way around and it was still attached, right? So it actually threads on. Yeah. It threads on, yeah. Well, that's kind of cool. Very, it sits nice for you. That's the thing is, if it's it. sitting like that, you gotta remember. Go you gotta go right. You gotta go right back. Yeah, I would've put it too far. Hold on, you want it sticking out of your frame. What's that? Just so it's not sticking out. Yeah. Let's oh, yeah. yeah. say right there. It's about it's as good, good as that. Uh, well, what if you put it back? Are going to hit the bar? No, uh, back here. Okay, well, just hold that thought for a second. Hold that thought. So yeah, I'm not sure when to stop recording, but there's my brackets. Just something simple to slide into and uh, hold it in place. Yeah. Easy peasy, lemon squeezies. And you just loosen it off, you can pull the whole unit right out. Like so, just loosen that off. Loosen this one off a bit. That's you need a bolt for that, but anyway, it just slides right out. As you can see, it'll lift up and slide out. That's the only second minute. I don't even think it. Oh, maybe. Oh yeah, so happy about the cable. Fuck yeah. Uh, so, so my clutch, brake, or accelerator. So this is gonna run down here. Anyway, it's working. I, I might put another one of cable on it, but as you can see, it. unfortunately, I need to spring to spring the pedal back. I think is what I'm gonna put on. Okay, guys. So I got my cable hooked up. The spring pull back wasn't quite enough, so now I got just a little spring on the side of my hook there. You can see that. Then my connector here has a third hole that the spring will hook into and it'll help it retract. Uh, it'll uh, help retract that extra long cable because the carbs don't quite have enough power, spring power to do it. It does it, but it's just not as crispy, crispy as I'd like it. Down here, I'm gonna probably change the pedal around a bit, but she comes back no problem. Crispy. Working on front cabled brakes.
one side wasn't even working. It works now. So there's the top. And then the bottom will be the hydraulic plate. Gas tank time. Breaking the bracket on the halo to release the top. Just remove screws and pry up to locate. Yeah, so anyway, so yeah, after all that drilling, guys, as you can see, I'm retarded some days. I have my times of retardation. Long moment. So yeah, should have just and took the panel off, and then, uh, so there's a screw underneath. I just broke the, the housing that holds the screw. The tab that needs to be broke. Lock mechanism off, and then I gotta plug this air vent here. Just gonna put some RTV on this hole now. So I got my, my lock. So yeah, I'm cutting for these on the dot. Drill hole with these. Yeah, man. So right now I'm just uh, stealing the top off of this tank, I guess is what I'm going to use. It's an old tank from I So I'm just going to cut it. Uh, so upon investigation. I think it's just braised in there, so I'm going to cut the next. Yeah. Then it's certain. Cutting more out to hopefully save the braze when welded. Sorry that's a bum angle. Guys, I uh, plugged my tank. It was uh, stupid to drill into it. I should have just took the thing off and ripped it off. I broke the plate, but it's holding it in there now. It smells um, like high oxygen. Anyway, uh, so I'm doing a leak test here quick to make sure that doesn't leak at all. Thank you. 
very nice. Ta-da! Leak test time. Alright, so yeah. Leak test number two. Great. Gas tank test with gas, right? First time. Okay, so we're gonna put some gas in this puppy. So yeah, as you guys can see, I just filled her up good. That goes down here to the pump. The pump goes around, down in both curbs, and both curbs nice and dry. Anyway, there you have it. Testing cord. Go, pretty That's not bad at all. Hey. Deciding on switch plate location. So what about if you put them here? Yeah, that's where I was thinking. Because you got both feet. Why should you handy? Both feet right there. Shifter. Exhaust time. So I have one, one ninja mirror here, and uh, what I did is I put the bracket around and put it upside down so it sits kind of up inside on the corner, and uh, I'll have to get another one for the other side, but it sits up in and out of the way, if it gets hit, it should hopefully not break. This piece acts as a handle and holds the wires. has a nice rumble now. Oh, yep. 
baby. for the last episode and a full oh, set yeah, again, yeah. thanks for watching yeah. of course stalls